What is up, my dudes? And that one girl wants to see a motorcycle gang roll through. This is Bikes, Beards, and Brews. Let's kick that intro. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Before we kick this one off, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell notification. New videos on Mondays, Wednesdays, Fridays, you know, when I'm not too busy or too lazy, whatever. But they are there. You should keep an eye out for them. Let's get the other stuff out of the way. Want to save 10% on a Cardinal Communicator? Check my referral link down below. Want to support me and all my do goodness like these cool guys here? Boom! Then you should become part of the brew crew and join the coffee page down below. Want to know why I'm asking you for money? Well, next to those 10,000 Amazon affiliate links where I also get a kickback there's a video telling you about all the stuff that I do with this money. Spoiler alert, it is not new motorcycle parts, hookers, and blow. Although that would be incredibly fascinating and fun to do. Um, you know, probably illegal or something. I don't know, whatever. So, yeah, just no. <laughs> so today, we're heading up to Laconia for the kickoff of Bike Week. Uh, who is we? Well, I have got this misfit crew with me. Let's do a cutaway. So we're at the meeting spot, getting ready to head up to Laconia. We have UCM Biggs, Dale, DA Bishop, Black Phoenix Entertainment, <laughs> Jerry <laughs> from Minamoto, and Dave, I don't know where the hell I'm going. <laughs> so we're gonna get on the road in a few. Yeah, so I got all of them. I did make a huge mistake before we left the gas station. I forgot to tell Ryan from Black Phoenix Entertainment to make sure he hangs back a little bit further if he sees other bikers around you know reputation upkeep and all that stuff so unfortunately we do have a tricycle in the gang um but eh, whatever it's gonna happen <laughs> oh ryan you know i'm kidding or am i <laughs> nonetheless uh yes yeah, so this year is the 100th annual Laconia Bike Week. It is the longest running motorcycle get together convent. I don't know, a bunch of dicks hanging out talking about the miles they ride while not mi riding miles uh, event in the country. So there you go. That's fun, right? All right. So yeah, let's get a little bit closer and let's see what we can see, right? All right, so we're clearly next to our destination because, well, we have arrived at the duck walk part of our day, which is always fun. Uh, so far, not too, too bad. This is one of the joys of coming up first thing in the morning because less, less people. <laughs> it has uh, started to rain a little bit again. So, well, that's a pain, but whatever, just make it work. Oh, so what'd you want to do at Laconia? Sit in the rain? Oh, me too. Sweet. Ah. Oh. Now, notice that Dave is taking everyone in the wrong direction again. <laughs> Dave never knows where he's going. So we're over here at Suspension Technologies. Peanut is very excited to be installing UCM pigs, shocks. You can see, I don't even know what's going on there. Dave is getting his front shocks done. Dave, remember last year? Yeah. You liked your, new, you liked your rear shocks so much you got front ones, right? That's right, man. <laughs> see, Suspension Technologies, way to go. Definitely come out here, get some shocks from them. Do it up. They're traveling all around, so any rally, you see these guys, go find Mike and Peanut and tell them to hook you up. All right, so we're up here in Laconia. We're at the Suspension Technologies tent. This is where I'm supposed to be doing the salad off with uh, Fly and Ride. He's supposed to line his bike up next to mine. 
Wow. Sorry, some dude in a tricycle just rode by. Um, he's supposed to line up his bike against mine, and we're supposed to decide which bike sounds better. But so far, I don't see Fly and Ride. Oh, wait, what's what's that in the distance? Oh, we're in a carrier pigeon. Hold on, let me let me see. Oh, brought to you by Law Tigers, apparently. Oh, it's a note from Fly and Ride. It says, Dear Bikes, Beards, and Brews, I was incredibly scared to come up there. In fact, I've already soiled my pants four times just writing your name on this letter. You win by default because I'm from New Jersey and we're all women down here who ride crappy, quiet bikes. I'm sorry I didn't get out of you. You're my hero. You're my legend. You're my superhero. Love, in a frightening way, fly and ride. Well, it was really nice of you, dude. So I guess I won by default. And uh, that's the way it rolls. So cool, let's go. Out of curiosity, have you guys already started the paperwork to get the restraining order on this guy? What? <laughs> Not well, yet. Well, I'll keep it. It's coming close. It's coming. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> Mine's still going through his process. He's in my pants. He's literally in my pants right now. So this is what you get when you're 60 years old. And this is what you get when you're 70 years old. <laughs> what do you think? Is it my color? Maybe, maybe. So the rain has not deterred people. This is still a great turnout and this is still early. There's still more rain to come, but whatever, it happens. Honestly, if there isn't rain, you're not at Laconia Bike Week. It's pretty standard at this point. Haven't seen Ryan in a while. I'm assuming, I can't confirm this, but what I'm assuming is he rolled up to like a bike gang or something, said he too rides, showed them his Riker, and they stuffed him in a porta potty. We haven't found him yet, so I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Hey Jerry, would you say it's a little moist? Moist. That's a good word. Moist. Musty. I have musty. Moist. Musty. Good. The moisty, moisty boss tones. Yeah. All right, we're gonna shoot over to Twin Barns, get some beer and some food. Uh, I'm not gonna hook up the cameras just yet because, well, it's still moist out. So uh, yeah, we'll, we'll meet you at the bar. So no lie, immediately after we parked, the clouds parted and the sun came out. This is ridiculous. Nonetheless, here we are. Laconia 2023, the 100th annual. Now here's the biggest problem that we had. Uh, we were supposed to go to Twin Barns to get some beer. So I figured I'd let Dave lead the pack and he overshot us, got this us lost. Check with Jerry. Pack. Jerry, did he get us lost? I hate you all. We, we didn't I make it there. Up. I hate you all. I hate yeah, you all. I hate you all. Yeah, I mean, so, so yeah, Dave got us lost again. Just like that video You're where Dave got us lost. <laughs> Uh, but you know, we're here, it's sunny, we're gonna have a good time. There's more assless chaps here than a Village People concert. It's pretty crazy.
All right, so we are rolling out of downtown Laconia. We're actually gonna try and get over to the uh, Speedway because, well, every year we try and go over there. We always show up after it's closed. And uh, I would kind of like to see what those vendors look like when they're open. Thankfully, the rain kind of let up for a little bit, so we'll test our luck all the way back down and uh, we'll, we'll see how that goes. Yeah, so right now is the part where we normally go fast and enjoy these curves and stuff, but the tricycle that thinks it's a car, like literally, this slingshot has a roof, windows, and doors. Just buy a goddamn car. What the hell are you doing, man? Seriously, you have just spent more money than a convertible to make your car, to make your thing a car with one less wheel. You suck, and you're just driving slow in it. I hate you. Oh, there's a sharp curve ahead, which means that slingshot's gonna do like 10 because he's afraid of life. Like, mm, I just bought a slingshot so I can feel the wind and stuff, but I'm also afraid of the weather, so I'm gonna put a roof on it. You're, you're a dumbass. I hate you. Should be nice if I could get out of second gear there, guy. Thanks a lot. All right, guys, we are rolling into the speedway. I guess the only real question here is, did we actually show up on time for once? It's looking promising, I'll say that. And uh, I did just see a sign that said beer, which makes it even better. So we shall see, let's, let's do this. So this whole thing closes at five o'clock every day. Like, what? A, it's bike week, it's Saturday. Come on, New Hampshire, stay a little longer. At least like seven, like, come on. Like the sun's not even going down at five. This dude really likes John Deere and death. Yeah. It's actually some pretty cool looking stuff on there. All right, so we're heading out of the speedway already. Uh, the place closes at five o'clock. What kind of crap is that? Uh, one of the vendors said that the speedway likes to close their gates by five. Okay, Boomer. Thanks a lot, dude. Anyway, I've told Sean from UCM Pigs and Jerry from Minimoto that there is an absolutely aw like awesome barbecue place up here in New England. So I want to bring them there and see what they think. So we're heading over to Casey's Rib Shack in Manchester. Honestly, if you're ever up in the Manchester, New Hampshire area, and you want some of the best goddamn barbecue on the face of the planet, Casey's Rib Shack is where you go. Bar none, full stop, period, the end. So we're gonna go do that now. So 
So we decided to make our own parking. Because, well, it's Casey's Rib Shack and this place is always packed. Oh, look, we got people. Hi. Just waiting on Sean. Well, you know. <laughs> oh, whatever. All right, so let's go and get some barbecue. All right, we are rolling out of Casey Bridge Jack. Casey's Rib Shack. Honestly, I wanted to record some stuff in there and I completely forgot. Uh, we just got lost in the moment, man. It was like having some beers, talking to some friends. It's really cool because like, you know, like Black Phoenix Entertainment, UCM Pigs, Mini Moto. These are guys that I talk to like all the time on like Instagram and through chats and stuff on YouTube. First time I've really got to meet these guys. Although I met Mini Moto um, a couple weeks ago when I went down to Jersey. But the other two and it honestly just all clicked it all felt really cool and it, you know it felt like these are people that i've known for like years it's crazy so yeah just totally forgot to record and all that crap and now we're just heading home and you know getting ready to do this all again tomorrow because <laughs> coming right back up here snagging uh some of the same people and we're gonna go do some more rides and that'll be the next video so make sure you catch that but until then, while we're stuck at this red light, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell notification, share this video with friends, share it with family, share it with that one dude you know who's like, I can't make it to Laconia this year, I wonder how it was. There you go, guy. And I'll see you all on the flip side.